Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Now before we jump into today's video, I have to say this. The following video is brought to everyone thanks in large part to the Amazon Vine program. But as always, I reserve the right to keep it straight 100 around here and my opinions are not influenced in any way, shape, form, or fashion. With that being said, Let's dive into today's video. Enjoy everyone, let's go. All right, everyone, now in this portion of the video, I'm just gonna give everyone my overall first impressions of the earbuds in terms of the packaging, presentation, the charging case, and the earbuds themselves. Then I'm going to try on the earbuds for everyone and give y'all my overall first impressions of the fit, feel, and the comfort. Then we're going to wrap this video up, okay? So without further ado, Let's dive into this first impressions portion of today's video. Now, first things first. <laughs> yes, I know these are pink, okay? 
that's all that Amazon had in the review catalog. So, best friend, if you watch my videos, I know you're going to be sending me a whole bunch of funny messages. Yeah, I know. They pink. It is what it is. At least it's pink and black. And pink and black do go very nicely with each other. Would I have preferred a straight black? Yes. Would I have preferred a black and blue? Yes. But all they had in the reviewer catalog was pink and black. So it is what it is. Yes, I know. I'm going to rock it. I, ain't have, I don't have any issues with the color. It is what it is. That being said, talking about the overall packaging and presentation, I have to say Soundcore did do a very good job. They did include pretty much everything you would like to see in terms of the packaging. If there was one issue that I had with the packaging, the included quick start guide basically had little to no information. And after reading it, I was very, very frustrated. Typically, when you have a quick start guide, it basically has everything that you need to know to get started. Like the button controls, the, that quick start guide did have the button controls, but it was very minimal and it didn't go over all of them. Like the battery life, it didn't have the battery life. Like the charge times for the buds in the case, didn't have the charge times for the buds in the case, right? Didn't have any of that, okay? And for as thick as that, that quick start guide is, slash user manual is, gotta do better than that sound core. Now, thankfully, these earbuds do support a companion application, and the companion application does give you the ability to configure the button controls the way you would like. And then thankfully, I am very adept at doing research across the internet, so I was able to find all the other specs and features that I put up in the first part of the video. But in terms of that, Soundcore, you guys gotta do a better job, right? It was very, very frustrating. I read through almost half the user manual and I'm like, oh, I was, it was so frustrating. I was ready to pack these bad boys up and send them back, okay? So, gotta work on that. But other than that, it was overall a very good unboxing experience. Talking about the first impressions with the charging case and the earbuds themselves, I do have to say, this is a really nice charging case. And I also really like the addition of the phone stand. That was a really nice touch. I like that. Okay. And I do like the subtle company branding on here as well. And then talking about first impressions with the earbuds, same thing. I do like that it's very clearly labeled right and left on each earbud. And I do like that it does have very subtle company branding on it. So that's a very nice touch. Now out of the box, these, comes, these come with the medium ear tips on them. And then they have the large and the small ear tips in the box. Um, let me try these on and see how I feel about it. So let's now talk about first impressions of the fit and feel. Let me drop the right earbud in first. Okay, that went right in there. Now let me drop in the left. Okay, that went right in there. And it does give me a very, very comfortable fit. Okay, let me do a quick shake test. Okay, they're not falling out. They're not moving around. So in terms of the comfort and stability, these are really, really good in terms of the first impressions. Now, real quickly, let me take some snaps so you guys and gals can see how the earbuds look in my ears and on my head. And then we'll wrap the video up. So, what are we going to use today? I'm going to use the Pixel 6a. Alright, so let me fire up the camera here. Okay, let me do a quick front profile. Boom. Let me do a quick side profile. Boom, that's one side. Let me do the other side. Boom. Now let me check these out. I 
Okay, this is this is not bad. Okay. All right, let me show y'all real quickly here. So here is the front profile. You can see it does look pretty nice. It is very minimal. If I zoom in, you can see. You can tell I have earbuds in, but you really gotta pay attention for it. So really, really nice. Then let me show you the other one side. Again, same thing. Nice, comfortable fit there. Not bad. And then let me show you the other side. Same thing. Not bad at all. Okay. Okay. All right. So first impressions of the overall fit and feel are actually really, really good. Now let me go ahead and pop them out and let's wrap up today's video. Come out very nicely as well. So very, very easy to put in and take out. And they do have a very, very solid fit as well. All right, everyone. So that does it for today's video. Once again, this has been an unboxing and first impressions of the Soundcore P30i Truly Wireless Bluetooth Earbuds. Now, as I said in the beginning of the video, this did come into the channel thanks in large part to the Amazon Vine program. So that means that I will have to write up and submit a written review first to be published on Amazon, and then I can dive into all of my video coverage after that written review goes live. So basically, if you follow me on Amazon, once you see that written review go live, you know the video coverage for these earbuds has started, all right? And we're gonna go over everything you guys and gals need to know about these earbuds in all of my coverage. So we're gonna do the mic test, we're gonna do the fit and sound demo, and everything will culminate with my full review, and I'm gonna let you guys and gals know if these earbuds are worth picking up. That being said, I will also have linked up down below the companion application to go along with these earbuds as well as affiliated purchasing links. So if your interest is peaked, down below in the video description will be like a one-stop shop for you guys and gals and you should be good to go. And if you make your purchase using those affiliated links, I do get a small percentage of commission that I do put back into the channel at no additional cost to you guys and gals. So the video description is basically like a one-stop shop for everyone and I consider those affiliated links a win-win for everyone. All right, today's video was recorded using the primary rear facing camera on the Samsung Galaxy S10e in 1080p at 30 FPS with no external microphone hooked up. And I am using my professional studio lights here today. So please let me know how you feel about the overall video quality as well as how you feel about the overall audio quality down below in the comments. Please remember to keep your comments respectful, please. That being said, I hope everyone's having a great day. I hope you guys and gals are staying safe out there and I will catch everyone in the next video. Have a good one, everybody. We're out of here. Peace. All right. Honestly, I'm super excited to test these. Uh, the battery life, the microphones, even some of the features. I'm super excited to, to test these. And I can't wait to dive into all of the continued coverage. So y'all stay tuned because we got more videos coming soon. Have a good one, everybody. We're out of here. Peace.